In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to find the volume of rectangular prisms using two different formulas. So, in this particular one, we're trying to find the volume of a fish tank or an aquarium that we, you might find in your science class or at your home. The dimensions are 2 by 5 by 3 feet. The length is 2 feet, the width is 5 feet, and the height is 3 feet. So we want to know what the volume, if we filled this tank to the top with water, what would be the volume? So you would just substitute length is 2, width is 5, and the height is 3. 2 times 5 is 10 times 3 is 30 cubic feet. That's how, that is the volume to fill this tank with water. Now the second formula I want to show you is related. Let's say you've seen um, boxes of grass seed and boxes of grass seed are about 10 centimeters high. Some of them. Small box of grass seed. If we knew what the area of the base is, without knowing what the length and the width is, we can still find the volume. The volume is the area of the base, which is 32 square centimeters, times the height, 10 centimeters. So the volume equals area of the base, of base times the height. So the area of the base here is 32 square centimeters times 10 centimeters and our volume of this box of grass seed is 320 cubic centimeters. You can write cubic like we did here or you could put centimeters to the third power. So there's two ways to find volume by formulas length times width times height and area of the base times the height. We don't even need to know the two dimensions. Something you probably don't know about pigs, a lot of people don't realize that pigs are very good athletes. Pigs are excellent swimmers.